Yo, what's going on team? Welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you all for clicking onto this channel and I hope you guys are having a good day so far. Today, we finally have a good day here in Wellington for me to go outside and shoot a lookbook for you guys. Collar Clothing has just sent through a package to me with some sick as killer clothing pieces. I can't wait to show these off to you guys. So let's get straight into the first outfit. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to the first outfit. Now, I'm currently here at my local train station, not too far from where I live. It's a little bit windy and it's Wellington, so you know it's the windy city. It's the windy city of New Zealand. It's the capital city of New Zealand. But you know what? With all that said and done, let's jump straight into the first outfit. Now remember, collar clothing sent through a box to me, filled with fire pieces. Can't wait to show these off. The first thing I want to show you guys is the pants. They call these the everyday cargo pants. Now, I think guys, these are now my favorite pants of all time. Why? There's so many reasons why. First of all, it's a slim fitting profile. Not too skinny, but also not too wide. It's perfect. It goes super well with these Air Jordan 1s I have on right now. The material is different. The material is this kind of like waterproof uh, nylon material. It's very lightweight and it's super comfortable. I think the whole pair of pants is actually waterproof. So you can easily wear these out in the rain and you don't have to worry about it. It has Imagine this guys, it has 10 pockets. It's got four on each side. So it has these zipper pockets um, that you put your phone in. Then you have a uh, Velcro pocket. Then you've got two more zip pockets on the side that are smaller to carry your smaller everyday goods. And then you've got two back pockets as well. It's crazy. It is super high quality and you don't expect any less from color clothing. So trust me guys, these pants are sick. Highly recommend these. Check out some of this B-roll. I also love the drawstring they have it's this like waxed dipped drawstring super high quality i prefer this over um you know normal drawstrings where you have to tie it this makes it a lot easier and a lot more low profile and at the same time around the ankle area has also got these drawstrings to give you a nice tapered fit um, as well as allows you to accentuate the sneakers you have on at the same time so these pants are absolutely crazy i'm wearing a size large and for size reference i'm usually a size 32 and these fit perfect so there you go hopefully that helps all right moving on to the t-shirt i have on so this t-shirt is just called the everyday basic tee it's in the color white i'm wearing a size large and to be honest guys i feel like it's a little bit oversized and baggy i would prefer maybe a size medium um, if i had the chance to go back and reselect my size so it's a basic tee it is crafted from an a custom milled 240 gsm cotton so it feels very high quality not flimsy at all it is enzyme wash for an extremely soft touch and it fits apparently true to size however i disagree i would go a size down on this if you want a more uh, fitted look on to the last piece i got this jacket here it's called the downtown varsity jacket super super high quality it's made out of distressed leather it has a wool body and it comes with inside pockets as well as two side pockets it is super clean i love how it's just fully black with a hint of white um, and it has a nice blacked out logo as well. So I'm wearing a size large at the moment and I think it fits me perfectly. I usually wear a size large on my jacket so it fits true to size. Um, and then lastly, I want to finish off or I'll cap it off with the logo cap. Super clean, super... I know you guys love this hat because you're always asking in the comment section where I get it from. So it's collar clothing and there you go. I'm also rocking in terms of shoes, the Air Jordan 1 bread toes. One of my favorite Air Jordan 1s of all time. And I feel like the red gives this outfit the pop it needs because of all the black and white I have on the upper. So I'm going to show you how it looks on body in, in totality. Hope you guys enjoyed this first outfit and then I'll catch you on the second outfit.
Yo, what's up guys? Outfit number two, here we go. Now before I jump into this outfit breakdown, I just want to say if you like any of the pieces I'm featuring here by Collar Clothing, I will leave a discount code right here. And make sure when you go to check out, chuck in this discount code, get a bit of a discount, and support me, and uh, we both win I guess. Let's jump straight into it. Now this one is a very, very straightforward outfit, but doesn't mean it doesn't look fine. The t-shirt I'm wearing here, is their basic t-shirt. I wore the white version of the same t-shirt in the previous outfit, this is just a black one. So fitting and, um, and construction is all the same. Nice thick material on the t-shirt and nice boxy fit as well. Again, it's a size large, but I'll probably prefer a size medium just because I prefer a little bit more of a fitted look, but still looks quite good. Uh, provides a more relaxed fit and more comfortable look. Now in terms of the denim, this is called their 101 Slates. Now this is a more of a skinny fitting denim and if you are someone who wants a bit more relaxed, definitely go size up. I'm wearing a size 32 at the moment and that is my true to size. So for you know a size reference, you can use me as a guide. Now in terms of the denim, they fit exactly how I would expect it to fit and it does really well to kind of provide you a bit of a stack on high cut shoes. So because I'm wearing these Air Jordan Vault Golds, um, they're a high cut, so you can see they stack quite well. If you're wearing a low cut sneaker, like, you know, like a Vans old school, they won't provide as much of a stack, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. This denim is constructed really, really well. It's got some really nice minor details that just puts it on a next level up compared to a cheaper denim. So every you know little button that has its own name and logo on it. The zips are made from YKK and they are good quality. And then this wash is just this medium blue wash. It has a hint of green and brown that sets it off quite nicely. And I think overall, if you're looking for a solid pair of denim, Collar Clothing is the place to go. They have different types of denim all over the website. So make sure you check them out and see which one you prefer. Cool, now because this is a fairly straightforward outfit, I decided to add in a few extra accessories. So this is actually their pearl necklace and it's made out of real pearl shells. It is tarnished and rust free. And you can see here it has a bit more of a tighter fit around the neck. It's, it's a really unique piece in my collection. I really like this uh, necklace actually because I don't have anything that's ever pearl related. So this is different and I like the way it fits and looks. It just adds a bit of extra flair to a black simple t-shirt. The next piece of accessories I'm wearing is, that's also from Collar Clothing, is this half pearl, half stainless steel chain bracelet. Um, and again, it uses very similar pearls as on the necklace, but I think just slightly smaller, but it has half of it in the stainless steel as well. So that's pretty much it for this outfit. I apologize if you hear quite a bit of background noise. I am currently in this abandoned park um, somewhere in uh, Horidoa, which is close to where I live. I just feel like it has a nice background for an outfit. So I hope you guys like this outfit and I hope you guys like the scenery and backdrop as well. So let's wrap up here and we'll jump into the third outfit. Okay, third and final outfit for this lookbook. And I'm sorry guys, my face is a little bit red. I probably got sunburnt filming this outfit lookbook, but you know what, it's worth it because I'm doing it for you guys. Let's jump straight into the third outfit. And for the sneaker for this one I chose is the Air Jordan 1 Shadow 2.0s that released earlier this year. Uh, initially had my doubts about this shoe, but I think the more I wear it and the way I style it, it's growing on me. So let's, let's see how this one looks. So for this outfit, the piece I went with to match the color of the shadows is this flannel. This flannel is Collar Clothing's signature flannel in the color white. And what's really cool about this flannel is that the buttons are made out of this marble pearl click-on buttons, so they don't have to be looped through a hole. I absolutely love this design and the way it operates. What's also really cool about this flannel is the wash. It's an enzyme wash with a faded chicken look. Absolutely, absolutely stunning. It looks super subtle. And notwithstanding that, the material that this fan was made out of is custom milled wool and it keeps you nice and cool throughout the summer. It's just a very solid and comfortable flannel and I highly recommend this piece, especially with the Shadow 2s. 
I'm wearing a size large for this flannel and it fits me perfectly um, because it is in slightly oversized flannel so if that's the look you're going for I reckon going true to size otherwise size down for a more fitted look for the t-shirt I'm wearing underneath the flannel it's just a basic white tee it's the same one I wore in outfit one so I won't go into detail but just know that basic tees provide you like a blank canvas and you can style all over it so that's the t-shirt now for the pants and excuse me as I grab my phone for this one because there's so many things going on with this pair of pants that I can't remember at all so this pair of pants is called the cropped cargo pants and they are very similar to the essential cargo pants I wore in outfit one however as the name suggests it is a cropped pair of pants and let me just say when I first tried it on I wasn't quite feeling it because the fitting was a bit tight and uh, it's cropped so it, it kind of you know it shows a bit more sock than I'm used to but when I put on the Jordans and completed the outfit for some shots I feel like it I feel like I liked it more than I initially thought. So having said all that, let's dive into some of the details. So the main details of the pants, apart from it being a crop pair, is the pockets, the cargo pockets. So there are three pockets on each side. There's two zipper pockets and one uh, flat pocket. And there's also two back pockets as well. So in total, there are eight pockets on this pair of pants. So that's very, very helpful. Um, outside of the aesthetics, it's very functional as well. What I also love about this pair of pants, and it's very, and it has the same detail as the first pair, the essential cargo, is the draw cord. So it has a draw cord with a catch, so you don't need to tie up your draw cord to tie up your pants around the waist. I really like that feature, just feels really high quality. The material used for this pair of pants is a slightly more thicker and a bit more stretchier than the essential cargoes in outfit one. The essential pair is a bit more lightweight. This one feels a bit heavier, but at the same time, comfort-wise, they're both fantastic. And to finish off, I want to talk about the sizing. I went for a size large in the crop pants, similar to my size in the essential pants. However, I feel like it is a bit narrow now down at the calf area. So if you do have slightly bigger calves, I recommend maybe going a size up. But I can make do with currently the size. Just bear in mind that, yeah, there are some slightly tighter areas. And that's it for every piece that Collar sent through in this video. I uh, again, I'm gonna leave a discount code on the screen somewhere here, just so you can make use of that. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this video. This took hell of a lot of time to, to do, and uh, got my face burnt as a result. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, leave a like if you do. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.